Hello everybody. It's Crafting Just Because with Chris Cowan. I hope everybody's having a fabulous Monday and had a great Mother's Day. Okay, so today we're playing with the Thoughtful Journey Designer Series paper. Whoops. And we're pairing that with the Unbounded Love Bundle. And I'm going to use Mossy Meadow, um, Blackberry Bliss, and then some basic white cardstock. And we're going to create a fun card. I might also throw in some of this um, braided natural twine. So let's go ahead and get started. I first want to die cut a couple pieces. So I'm going to go ahead and bring in uh, um, my cut and emboss machine. We're just going to use the mini one today. And we're going to... We're going to die cut a frame. Let me bring in the stamp set so I can show you guys. Um, we're going to do this. Hope is believing in a brighter tomorrow. So we're going to do in believing in a brighter tomorrow on the inside. But I want to do a frame for the hope. And this set has great frames to do that with. So we're going to use this little one here, and I'm going to cut it, um, let's see here, I'm going to cut it twice out of basic white and once out of the Blackberry Bliss, so that that way, one, I have um, a frame, or a, a piece to... Let me use some post-it tape since this is such a little piece. Um, so that I have a piece to stamp on, but then I also wanted to layer layer it up a little bit. So I'm just going to put that down there. Perfect. There's our piece to go to stamp on. And then we have our frame right there. And I'm going to do it one more time. There's our frames to layer up, and then let's do it once out of the Blackberry Bliss so that I have a color for the top. There we go. Okay, so let's put this away. I'm gonna put my die away. I'm gonna bring out my stamp set. And we're going to use the Mossy Meadow ink. And I'm going 
to grab my piece that we're going to stamp on. I was going to do the hope. Hmm. Let's try it one more time on this other one. See if I get a darker. I might need to get these re-inked. That one's better, so we'll layer that one on top. And then I need a piece for the inside of our card since we're using Mossy Meadow card base. And I need a piece that's four and one eighth. Oh, good. It's already done that by five and three eighths. Perfect. And then we're going to stamp the other sentiment on the inside of that card. bigger block and we're just going to stamp that right in the center of our inside piece so that's all of our stamping and then let's go ahead and glue those frames together so that that part's all done and drying while we're cutting the rest of our card. Okay. I'm just gonna layer those on top of each other. So there's that, and then let's do our little frames here. Sorry, I'm adding the glue close to me, not on camera. Silly me. Whoops. And one more. Oops. Make sure you get your them all lined up. There is a way. Okay. So now we're going to bring in our paper trimmer. And we want to cut a card base that is four and one eighth by, a, or sorry, four and a quarter by 11. Okay. And then we're going to score it in half at five and a half on the 11 inch side. Then I'm also going to cut a piece of Blackberry Bliss cardstock. And I want this cut at three and a quarter. By three and three quarters. Uh oh, did I mess that up? No. Oh, it was supposed to be four and three quarters. Okay, hold on. Hold on. I have a plan. Let's cut this at five and three eighths. Can't believe I cut that down too short. 
by four and an eighth. Okay, and then we'll do Mossy Meadow and we're gonna do four and three quarters by three and a quarter. Okay, now I'm gonna bring in a piece of my designer series paper and we wanna cut two strips that are one and a half inches okay and then on the first one we're going to cut it at three inches and then at one and a half and we're just going to set them on the side here And then on the second piece, we're going to cut it at one and a half. And then three inches. Okay. So now we're done with our paper trimmer. Let's bring in our small uh, mossy meadow piece. And we're gonna glue down our designer series paper, leaving a little border around the whole thing. So it's like about an eighth of an inch of a border. Perfect. Then what we're going to do is we are going to tie some of this. Well, actually, we're not tying. I'm not going to tie it. I'm just going to wrap this around and we'll secure it with some tape. Just because I have the best luck with that. Okay. Um. We're just going to do one end just like that. Whoops. And then the other end. Put one more piece right up here. Make sure I got that okay. And then we're going to use dimensionals to add this to our white, basic white piece that we cut. Just like that. side piece in and 
just like that. Then we're going to glue this onto the front. Just like so. And then we're going to glue down our sentiment. You know what might be better? Hold on. Let's put a little bit of foam tape on each side because of that ribbon. Just like that. And then we'll glue our frame around. Just like that. Super simple card. I think it's really pretty. And it's a nice way to combine these two sets. The Unbounded Love and then the, um, the Thoughtful Journey designer series paper. So until next time, my creative peeps, I will see you later. I hope you have a blessed night. Bye-bye.